Go ahead and notice the distance over the net, the shape of the ball. Distance over the net equals depth. The only time you want to go short in the court is when you're going with a slice or you're going for a severe angle. But a topspin ball that bounces in the service box is ineffective unless it's to the angle. And that all that does is allow your opponent to move forward and to attack. So you notice that these girls are putting a nice shape on the ball and giving themselves depth. Distance over the net equals depth. The way that you give yourself distance over the net is by sinking, getting below the height of the ball, and lifting the ball. You have to trust your topspin. That's a way to fight it off. All right, girls, step up, take some volleys. We're going to hit plenty of groundies later. Our ratio between baseline play and net play and overheads is about 75, 25, 60, 40. Uh, most coaches and most tennis teams will play 90% of baseline stuff and only 10% around the net. We don't do that. Our philosophy is about 40% around the net, 35% around the net, and the rest baseline stuff. Uh, when you get somebody in trouble from the baseline, you must be willing to step up and finish off the point around the net. And particularly in doubles, you must be able to trust your overhead or else you're just not going to come in. So you'll see in today's video, we spent a lot of time around the net and overheads. That's the way to let the ball travel there, D. Get on your strings, that's it. 